Hi, it's Katrina. From buses made by 3D printers to intelligent trucks that can communicate with each other, here are eight of the coolest trucks and buses of the future you have to see. Number 8. Ollie The company Local Motors from Arizona created an electric shuttle that's 3D printed and partly recyclable, and it's the first vehicle to use IBM's Watson Cognitive Platform for automobiles. The amazing thing about this vehicle is that it was a revolutionary concept that was just printed out. The idea isn't just to make a new vehicle and make some extra money, but to reshape the car making business top to bottom. Since it's made of 3D printed materials, it will lower production costs significantly. Ollie is a minibus that can read the road. It uses a laser sensing system known as LiDAR, which is also used by Google's driverless cars. It also has additional sensors for remote supervision and can measure and track its speed and take safety precautions. One of the best safety improvements on it is the so-called got-to-stop haptic sensor. This sensor allows Ollie to stop as soon as it makes contact with anything in its way, preventing accidents. And thanks to modern technology, it can even communicate with its passengers. Through voice commands, passengers can tell Ollie where to take them. The manufacturers plan to have it ride on campuses and airports, but also in urban areas. Some U.S. states, such as Michigan, are opening up to driverless vehicles and passing laws to allow it. So the future looks pretty bright. You might see Ollie very soon. Number 7. Nikola One This is a futuristic vehicle from the Nikola Motor Company. Many important people from the industry consider it a game changer, and it probably is. This truck has six electric motors and can reach 60 miles per hour in just 30 seconds. But its fantastic features don't end here. Apart from being a one mean machine, it's also a luxury apartment. It has two full-size beds, a 40-inch TV, as well as additional appliances such as a microwave, freezer, and refrigerator. And now listen to this. It also has several high-definition cameras, radar, and sonar. With this state-of-the-art equipment, the driver can have an aerial view of both the truck and the trailer. Therefore, there will be no more blind spots and the overall safety will be increased. Technically speaking, Nikola One is a hybrid. It uses a 320 kilowatt battery and a 300 kilowatt fuel cell. It weighs 2,000 pounds less than a classical semi-truck and its cruising range is up to 1,200 miles with all the benefits of electric propulsion. Since fuel can be a problem, especially for long distances, the Nikola One company came up with a brilliant idea. They will make a network of hydrogen stations across the USA and Canada and the construction is scheduled for January 2018. This is a pretty massive plan with Nikola One and the string of gas stations, but it's definitely doable. Some experts predict that it will take a couple of years to make all those stations, but this string of hydrogen stations will benefit other vehicle manufacturers as well. Companies such as Toyota or Honda could use that infrastructure to power their own vehicles. All in all, if everything goes according to plan, Nikola One is about to change the whole trucking industry. Number 6. Navia Arma this is a self-driving bus with 15 seats which can be programmed for a variety of short distance trips. All it needs is an inductive charging station and it's ready to roll. This mini bus, or shuttle as it's also called, has top-notch sensor technology, LiDAR, GPS, RTK, odometer, and camera stereo visions. This enables it to identify road and traffic signs to detect objects in its path and map out its surroundings. The only downside to Arma is its speed. It isn't designed to go very fast as its maximum speed is just 45 km per hour, but the speed will probably be limited to 30 km per hour due to the nature of the vehicle. Arma is meant to be a complement to public transport for distances that are too far to go on foot, but too short to go by car. At the moment, there is a lot of testing going on in France, and engineers expect everything to go on as planned. Early next year, a five-year trial will start. If the whole testing process goes well, we can expect this handsome devil on our roads in the near future. And now for number five, but first be sure to subscribe before you leave. For those of you who are already subscribed, welcome back! Number five, WAVE Walmart Truck. Over the years, Walmart has worked on creating a new vehicle to be one of the best in the market. They want a fuel-efficient, aerodynamic, and hybrid truck to replace all existing ones. Lo and behold, the Walmart Advanced Vehicle Experience. WAVE, as it has come to be known, is a prototype for a delivery truck destined to reduce emissions and increase efficiency. 
This truck prides in having light construction and advanced aerodynamic features. It has a micro turbine and it can run on natural gas as well as other fuels without any emissions. Its cockpit is a state-of-the-art concept. It looks more like a plane than a truck, thus enabling the driver to have better visibility. This was achieved by placing the driver right in the middle. As for the truck's trailer, it's also revolutionary in design. It's mostly made up of carbon fiber, saving almost 4,000 pounds compared to older designs. Walmart claims that this is the first carbon fiber trailer ever produced and that the 53-foot side panels are the first single pieces of carbon fiber that big. Wave's trailer also has a convex nose which gives it additional aerodynamics efficiency. It is 4,000 pounds lighter than a conventional trailer, which means that the truck can carry more freight without increasing fuel consumption. All in all, this truck can definitely be called a vehicle of the future. Because of its design and features, it will definitely usher in some major changes in the transportation industry. Number 4. Willy Bus this bus represents a futuristic concept for public transportation. It was designed by Tad Orlowski and the idea was to replace the bus walls with transparent LCD screens. Wait, what? Have all the walls replaced with LCD screens? Yup, that's the idea. This concept actually falls under the category of mobile advertising. The point of having an LCD bus is to have commercials or movie trailers as well as tourist information, news summaries, and weather reports right there for everyone to see. I think I've seen something like that in Vegas. Of course, this sounds amazing, but there is also the question of safety. The bus will act as a moving TV, but there is definitely the problem of having other drivers distracted. For now, the concept was thought out more in the area of its design and less in the area of its functional technicalities, so let's not worry about that. Although the concept has its problems, the LCD bus Willy has caught the attention of many European cities, but no moves have been made yet because the regulatory constraints are too complicated for the time being. However, there have been some talks about revisiting the original idea and reaching a compromise. Maybe for now, the best solution would be to use smaller LCD screens instead of covering the whole bus. Anyway, Willy the bus is here one way or another. Number 3. Teb Transit Elevated Bus Now this is something else. This is a concept for an elevating bus that could ride above the traffic. China is facing a ton of traffic problems and the country really needs to rethink its traffic solutions and come up with something new. And this bus could be a breath of fresh air. The vehicle can go 60 km per hour and move along rails that would be laid on streets and roads. One of its biggest advantages would be the saving of road space. It would have all the major functions of a subway, but it would cost five times less, and it could replace 40 conventional buses. At least that was the idea, and it has been lingering around for years until a mini model was finally shown at the Beijing High Tech Expo. Everyone was hyped up about this, but it didn't last long. The test drive for the bus didn't go well, and eventually the project was scrapped. But it doesn't end there. In July 2017, more than 30 people who were involved in this project were detained by Chinese authorities because of alleged investment fraud. But the idea for a similar type of bus remains. There is also the concept of ART, the Autonomous Rail Rapid Transit, which is like a cross between a train and a tram. This concept comes from a Chinese company, CRRC, and it's currently under construction. And it will see the light of day in the months to come. Apparently the Chinese never give up. Number 2. The Z-Truck This amazing vehicle comes from the Iveco company and it will definitely be one of the game changers in the industry. The Z in its name stands for zero, which means zero CO2 emissions, zero accidents, and zero driver's time. Of course, in reality, it's still not quite there yet. The more accurate name for this truck would be close to zero, but it just doesn't have the same ring, does it? Its engine runs on liquefied natural gas in the form of biomethane and the fuel is stored in an aluminum tank, protected by foil from heat radiation. It has excellent aerodynamics, an energy recovery system, and a range of 2,200 kilometers. The truck's cabin has the human-machine interface, where the driver can read all the data on tire wear, pressure, and temperature. For easy viewing, the data is actually projected onto the windshield. It's like something out of a sci-fi movie. The cabin also has amazing designs. There is a foldable bed, a refrigerator, and a small kitchen, along with a sliding wall that can add 20 inches more space if need be. When it comes to bringing in some amazing changes, the Z-Truck means business. Number 1. The Mercedes-Benz 2025 This future truck is definitely the most revolutionary concept to hit the trucking industry. It doesn't have a weird-looking design, and it doesn't have super crazy features, but it is a self-driving truck. 
It is still a prototype, but the Mercedes company is doing all in its power to turn this model into a reality by the year 2025. The concept of self-driving cars is nothing new, but the trucking industry is still developing in this area, and the need for self-driving trucks is definitely there. It's much safer to let a computer drive a truck on the highway, as every year there are thousands of traffic accidents involving trucks due to human error. This truck will be driven by the automatic system called the Highway Pilot. It's fully automated so the driver doesn't have to do anything, and the truck can handle all sorts of traffic maneuvers. It can pull into the other lane to pass a car, or pull over to allow more room for vehicles coming from behind. The most amazing feature of the 2025 model is the vehicle-to-vehicle -vehicle system. By employing this system, a truck would not depend solely on its sensors. It will use the V2V system to communicate with other vehicles through the vehicle-to-infrastructure network, as well as satellite navigation. This is the principle of the so-called shared intelligence, and it will definitely revolutionize our idea of traffic and transport. And this is just the beginning. If the 2025 model offers all this, who knows what we could expect in the upcoming decades? Thanks for watching. Remember to subscribe before you leave and click the notification bell so you don't miss out on new videos. See you next time. Bye!